The Buffalo Common Council is sending a letter to the state controller's office after the city controller failed to submit an audit promised by today's Common Council meeting. Now, back in September, council members requested an audit of city employees that were on paid administrative leave. And Tunia Sides Kelly Dudzik joins us now with more about what actually led up to this letter being sent to the state. Kelly? Yes, yeah, Scott and Mary Alice, the Common Council requested this audit after our partners at Investigative Post did a story about a city employee who made more than $600,000 while out on paid administrative leave for years. The audit was requested in September to make sure no other cases slipped through the cracks. A week ago, the city's chief auditor told council members a detailed report would be given to them by today. And that didn't happen. Common Council member Mitch Nowakowski spoke with the city controller Barbara Miller Williams this afternoon, and she told him she has no issue with this letter going to the state. This has really been a back and forth, and I'm done playing uh, personalities and politics with this when at the end we really need to get to the bottom of this matter to make sure that nothing happened elsewhere. And so that's why we have a New York State controller um, to not only see what the, our own controller has provided, um, but to go with a thorough review uh, on this matter. The city controller also told him that she expects to have the audit done in a week or two. The letter will go to the state controller's office asking it to look into this issue. On your side, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.